Oracle SQL Developer version 4.0 has many, many features for the database administrator. Most of these can be found under the View menu in the DBA panel, which you can see here. Once you have a connection added to the DBA panel from your list of existing connections, you can connect to your database, view its current initialization parameters, make changes to those parameters, save them back to your SP file or to the database, and see who's using what in the database in terms of licensed features. We have a wizard for running data pump, exports and imports. You can also see existing uh, jobs and execute those jobs if they're there. Uh, the performance page is brand new for version 4.0 and this is available if you're an enterprise edition and have the diagnostics pack licensed. You can view uh, existing snapshots. You can sort your snapshots uh, to ones that have uh, automatic database diagnostic monitoring findings. Drill into that snapshot and view the findings report directly. You can create new snapshots, delete existing ones. You can also manage your baselines for frequent uh, snapshot windows that you want to feed to a report. Automatic database diagnostic monitoring page shows you uh, your available reports. You can change your parameters, and of course, you can click into these reports. Probably the feature that will be used most in this uh, new set of performance items is the, autom the automatic session history report viewer. So by default we'll show you everything that's happened in your la in your database in the last five minutes. If you'd prefer to see this in your browser, you can feed this over to your default browser or save it to an HTML file to share with other coworkers. I can always change the parameters of the report. Basically you have the ability to set predefined time periods or be very specific with the time pickers and you can also add filters. So now I'm seeing what SQL Developer has done in the last hour in terms of sessions in the database. We also have a interface for uh, RMAN, so you can run RMAN wizard to set up a backup or recovery operation. You can see existing backup jobs. Resource manager allows you to manage your consumer groups. So for example, if you want a group of users to have their database connections time out after a certain period of inactivity, you can do that from here. Security is all about managing um, database auditing. So you can see your existing audit trails and audit settings. roles in users. So I can reset a password for a user, I can expire a user, I can edit a user, grant them new privileges and roles, or I can administer the role itself. And lastly we have storage. So you have the ability to, for example, manage your table spaces. I can see all of my table spaces here. Drill into a table space. Add a data file or edit an existing data file.
We also have some uh, reports for DBAs, or reports that might be interesting to DBAs. So under the Reports viewer, under Data Dictionary Reports, you have about your database, um, things about AS, A, ASH and AWR reports, and then of course Database Administration Reports. So top SQL, top SQL by weights. So for the last 30 minutes, here's what we have going on. These reports are customizable. You just need to drag them down to the user-defined reports to make changes to them.